Hey, this is Chopstick. I'm with Bianca Swanfitch, and I'm here today with her because she's going to teach us five tips on having a successful YouTube channel. For the first question, um, I know you run the theater arts department in the MSJC, so how do you go about running it in general? Well, I do run the theater department at MSJC. Mm -hmm. um, I teach a few classes about acting and theater history, but my favorite thing that I get to do is I actually get to direct two theatrical productions a year, and okay. that is probably my favorite part of my job, is to be able to take a production from beginning to end and watch an audience really enjoy my work. So that's my favorite part. Yeah, that's, the, that's a really good part, because uh, thinking of it, like if you're talking to a friend or family, it's like a lot of importance and they know a lot so it's just gonna be like a lot of feelings put into it just you could say that just imagine it to a bunch of thousands of people and it could spread out to millions so I know one you, day hopefully mm -hmm. <laughs> so um other than that um, do you have any tips for presentation like for um, like starting a new channel or just yeah this in general like starting a new like something just recording and putting yourself on camera well yeah I mean what I usually tell my acting students is to make sure that you start with confidence, right? Mm -hmm. And that you're comfortable in your own skin, right? And that you be yourself, right? Um, a beginning actor always needs to start out with knowing who they are, what their strengths and weaknesses are, and being confident in that, right? And mm -hmm. not trying to be anybody else because you, there's only one person that's as special as you, right? And being somebody else could get you lower views or just not as like, it doesn't feel the same as somebody being themselves. So um, since, since it's like a YouTube and t television and stuff like that, do you require to write a script for YouTube videos and social media videos like that? I don't think a script is really going to help um, help you succeed with a YouTube channel because YouTube is all about personal connection with your audience and I think what's really important is that you be yourself and you have a plan if you know what you're gonna do for that episode I would say you know write an outline but not write a script because you want to you want to be natural you want to be yourself and you want it to flow and you want to have a, a real connection with your audience yeah you have to have like a natural conversation rather than you like your friends and uh, people on stage won't be ex excited as before if you wrote a script or if you didn't write a script. So um, speaking of that, like in YouTube and posting videos, how do you go about um, like getting into the algorithm? Do you know anything that um, like touches it and strikes and triggers the algorithm to boost your views or anything? Well, I don't know about algorithms, but I do know about people. And I know that mm -hmm. people want to see people that are genuine. And I would say focus on being um, authentically you, right? And delivering that to your audience. And also always remind all of your, the people that watch you to like and subscribe and make sure that you encourage them to share the video, right? Your core people, the first people that are gonna see your videos are your core, your family, your friends. And those mm -hmm. are the people that are gonna like and share and begin to spread that to- Spread that to, to friends, to friends. Exactly. To friends of family and friend, family But don't worry about the algorithm. Mm -hmm. Worry about being genuine and being your authentic self. And that is what's going to grow your channel. Yes, yeah, so growing your channel is all about just being you and doing yourself and as you said, have an authentic look into your channel and all your videos. So um, basically all I want to say is, uh, do you have any more questions about mine, my channel? Like how I started or what inspired me? I'd love to know about your channel. What, what exactly yes. do you do on your channel? It's a cooking channel. So what I do, what inspired me was um, uh, a lot of California chefs and Mr. Beast. So you know how California chefs, they cook really high-end meals and dishes. And YouTuber Mr. Beast, he gives back to his community. So I, what I want to do is I want to mix that up into one and cook as soon as, as well as me make, giving back to the community and people who got me here. I think that's awesome. I can't wait to see your channel. Yes. Can't wait to see what you're going to cook. <laughs>
Thank, thank you, Bianca, Bianca, and um, I'll love to see you again and cook with you. If I could get you, if I could get a hold of you, I would like to cook with you. I'd love it on my channel. Sounds fun. Let's do it. Hey, this is Chopstick with Chopstick TV. You guys, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you know when I upload another video. And if you want to comment any suggestions down below, I'll love to reply with that and do it with do what you recommended. Thank you.